Astro Guy Podcast. I'm not an expert. I'm an amateur like you. I'm here to learn and here to teach. So let's enjoy the ride together. Carpe Noctum. Seize the night. I'm your host, Wayne Zool, and this is the Astro Guy Podcast. This is a very special episode, albeit a short one. Uh, It was about a year ago that I first recorded the the very first episode of the Astro Guy podcast. That was What's Up in the September 2021 Skies. And it was a lot of fun, and I've had a lot of feedback, and uh, it's actually grown quite a bit, and I'm I'm really pleased with that. Uh, There's going to be a few changes in, in the coming year. Uh, nothing major. Uh, at this point, I'm still going to be doing two episodes a month. Uh, I'm going to keep doing the what's up in the sky each month, and that'll always be released uh, right around the, the first uh, of the month or a couple days prior if there's a lot of things happening on the first. Um, I have uh, several guests lined up that are going to be uh, speaking um, for interviews. I've got, uh, there's going to be a lot of different topics. Um, there's going to be a great one coming up about the moon, the formation of the moon and a lot of lore and history. Uh, there's just going to be some talks about astronomy history as well. Astronomy clubs, uh, things coming up in the sky. A lot of things are going to be coming up as far as interviews go. Uh, And that's going to be a lot of fun. I know I have an awful lot of fun recording them and, uh, based on the downloads and the views, you people have, uh, my listeners and fans, uh, have a lot of fun. Uh, watching and listening to those podcasts as well. <clears throat> um, I plan on doing a, a bit more on uh, astrophotography. Um, I've been doing a lot of deep sky astrophotography myself. Uh, I even want to do some live uh, videos that I'll put on the YouTube channel uh, as well as uh, Facebook Live, and then they'll be available on YouTube uh, for video download. The audio is not going to be very exciting uh, as it's going to be live stacking of deep sky objects. Um, I've done a little bit of it. I've tested it out. It works. uh, And I'm going to be perfecting that and doing that uh, with different objects coming up uh, in the very near future uh, and hoping to do more of those. In fact, I'm planning to do one on uh, the Andromeda galaxy. I'm working on a project right now with the the Veil Nebula, and I might do live stacking with that. I haven't decided yet. Uh, And I'll also be doing some things with uh, planetary imaging as well. Um, I I will tell you that the episodes that I've done about astrophotography are the most downloaded and most watched uh, ones. And uh, I'm a fan of it. It's it's something that kind of really brought me back fully into the hobby. Um, and it's, it's, it's something I enjoy. And I think a lot of other people do as well. So hopefully, uh, you'll find that, uh, interesting and and that'll keep you coming back for more. I'm also going to be expanding the great astronomer series. Uh, so far we have two uh, of those done. Uh, we did the Charles Messier episode and the William Herschel episode. Um, I'm most likely going to do one on Caroline Herschel, uh, Sir William's sister. Uh, and his son, John, as well. And there's a lot of other uh, great astronomers that I'll be uh, doing episodes about. And the nice thing with those is they're very informative. There's a lot of information, and they're, they're, they're not too long. They're usually 20 to 30 minutes long. Uh, and I'm hoping that you find them interesting. So that's going to be uh, other episodes that will be coming up besides the interviews and what's up. Uh, also, if there's any uh, updates on important space missions, I know the DART mission, uh, anything with James Webb, things like that, uh, even Artemis, uh, which is going to launch uh, in uh, uh, just, just a few days uh, or, or a week or so uh, after I release this. Um, so, you know, those things, I'll probably do episodes on that. Uh, keeping everything free right now. Um, I don't have a Patreon. I'm not asking people for donations down the road. That may change. It depends on on what you guys want. 
um, you know, it's, I'm trying to keep this as accessible to everybody, but I have some really great speakers, uh, uh, you know, that I'm going to be uh, coming on as guests to interview. And I think that you're going to find them really valuable. Um, you know, if people want me to start testing equipment and things like that, then I may have to uh, do the, go the Patreon route to help fund that. Uh, it's, you know, most other uh, astronomy YouTube channels do the same thing. And, you know, right now I'm not asking anybody for anything. I'd like to keep it free, but down the road that may change. But uh, those two episodes a month are always going to be free no matter what. Uh, and the last thing that I really want to say, well, there's a couple other things, but um, I did have a little COVID-induced vacation. Uh, unfortunately, thankfully, uh, it worked out, and I am perfectly fine and recovered, and I'm very happy about that, and I hope that uh, everybody else is uh, staying COVID-free and staying safe. Um, one of the things that uh, I did recently was I was up at the Stellafane Convention in Vermont, I uh, actually want to do a whole episode about Stellafane. And even in the Great Astronomer series, I may do an episode on Russell Porter, uh, who was the founder of the modern uh, amateur telescope making movement and founded Stellafane. So uh, I think that's going to be interesting for everybody. And uh, I'm working on getting uh, some people from the Springfield Telescope Makers, which is the club that uh, Stellafane. Uh, it, where, where it's located, and I am a member there, um, but I'm, I have some members that are going to be coming on. And the other thing I really want to do is uh, I'd love to do a panel uh, discussion, and it'd be really easy to do using Zoom because people are spread out all over the world, uh, and do one about meteorites. I think that would be a lot of fun. Uh, it's definitely related to the hobby, and uh, as a, a collector myself, it would be fun for me, but uh, I know some, some uh, people who go out and do collecting, uh, and it, it's pretty exciting. It's, it's a very adventurous uh, work, so I think that'll be a lot of fun, too. Uh, so if you like the podcast and if you find it helpful in any way, um, one of the things that I would appreciate a lot is if you could please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Uh, and share it with your friends and any family you know that might be interested in it. Um, you know, I'm finding a lot of people are, are very interested in astronomy and they don't know where to look or, or where, to, where to get information about it. Um, some of my astrophotography I actually set up in front of my house because there's a lot of trees in my backyard. Uh, so I have to sit out there with my equipment while it's taking pictures and uh, I get kids and, and people walking by and they go, oh, what are you looking at? And I tell them, well, I'm actually taking pictures. But then we get into discussion and I'll take out my phone and I'll show them some of the pictures I've taken. And they're blown away. And I have long conversations with people while I'm out there taking pictures. So it's actually a lot of fun uh, for me. And I, I really just want to help spread the, the, the fun that this hobby is and, and help people understand where we are in the universe and and what fantastic things are out there that they can see uh, and that they can have fun and appreciate. So spreading the word about the, the audio version of the podcast and uh, leaving reviews is really helpful if you could do that. And again, subscribing uh, is huge and, and you know, liking it and commenting, just having activity on the channel. And hopefully you can't hear my dog barking, but uh, I thank you for listening in. And uh, I'll put up the slides uh, that I always put up at the end so you know the address of the YouTube channel and uh, of, of where to, how to contact me uh, through email or through uh, uh, voicemail. So anyway, thank you again for tuning in. And as always, Carpe Noctum, seize the night. I'm Wayne Zool, and this was the Astro Guy Podcast. Thank you for listening. As always, your questions, comments, and suggestions are welcome. Keep wondering. Keep your eyes on the sky. Have fun. Carpe Noctum. Seize the night.